Introducing first, standing at 5 foot 10, 220 pounds, coming from the woods of your mind. Ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you the World Assassin! of the first participant in the pre-show, first of two pre-show matches, Wolf Assassin. One of eight different title holders for that hardcore championship at Uprising. He has made Safe Haven a haven of sorts for popularity. If you remember Cruz Knight. hardcore environment over his resume of the past half season that he was a part of Revolution. He's made hardcore quite something special in his career. A former hardcore champion. broadcast of both those programs and we saw quite the shadowy figure walking from the rather dark alleyway driveway next to a building of some sort this might have been the surprise that we were uh, I guess bear witness to chaos a former FYW wrestler he's never been in revolution Quite a complicated history, also a very successful history. We are indoors and squaring off with chaos. Wolf Assassin, no slap, neither is chaos. Former global champion, former American champion. Quite the successful play of your resume. And then, if my memory is correct, and I've only been a part. In the revolution era, as opposed to the FYW. Chaos would later unmask as a result of losing a tables match in 3D. The former devastated Dane Dempsey. He would later change his name and whatnot. Of course, forgive me for the evil story. This is the first day of the season. The Animal Tribute to 2015. We couldn't get to the formal introduction, we will. As the day progresses, Cam's the Wolf flies back and forth, DDT. Planning. Wolf's face down into the mat. We are at Safe Haven once again, 210 North Bloomington Street in Streeter, Illinois. It's a recreational facility. Oh! Nice drop kick to the chest. Had to get the fans riled up. That's a short time ago, we introduced Pimpin' Pablo, and now the new ring announcer, with the elbow from the top. Cast very aerial in his offense. Very technical, very lucha inspiration in some of his moves. So he has that edge with Wolf, although we've seen Wolf come off the corner post. He's got those powerful spears and clotheslines being authoritative. Chaos barely getting up. Like we said, Safe Haven, this is the first time in 15 shows 
this season, mentioned on the Revolution Report a few days ago, the agreement reached in the offseason because of the overwhelming success and notoriety of Cruise Right and the Road to Uprising. We reached an agreement with this particular facility. We would like to thank those who gave us the go to come back for one more run, or in our case, a full season's worth of shows, both paper and in the ground. It's a brew one from Wolfen. Kick off. Uh. Yes, if I understand, also a former hardcore champion in the Revolution era, but this is the first time we've seen chaos in the ring in Revolution. Back then it was a base trampoline, but we're getting into the real deal of things. Stretching the back right now. Fans bringing chairs from the front. It's going to probably end up being standing room only. We've got legions of fans filling the seats on both sides, my left and my right, right now. Anticipation is at a fever pitch. We were going to do this show outdoors, but it's probably 30 degrees outside, 39 degrees outside. So I'd call it unseasonal because they're wearing a jacket. to an 11, but long stepping up in a close line that time. Okay, I'm going both ways before running four under the chest. Wolf placed. Second turn buck go. Uh oh, now gonna go up top. Chaos goes up. Swan time! Head beats chest cover! Two count. Long Island Ice T, your official for the first of two pre-show matches. We got another one upcoming, both unadvertised online. But there are many more matches for you fans to watch to stick around that we can oh, no. block. Okay, trying to go for a kick. Wolf. Oh! Sitting down on it. Looks both legs. Oh, most the victor. Wolf known for that leg drop coming off the top turn buckle. We saw that in the Hardcore Battle Royal. One of the biggest shoots in that particular afternoon. But Wolf, as I had in the winning ways. In fact, the last time he won was Road to Uprising. Here at Safe Haven. He's gonna set for that spear. Chaos, stirring. Up to the gun, spear! That's gonna put him away! No! Pick out it too! Wolf Assassin, still very much a newcomer in Revolution, but putting up that fight with the veteran in chaos. Another could have been to the jaw from this particular angle. Now this is the boost in. Nice one. Oh, no, Hurricane Rana! And chaos, the very lucha experience, but there's a little bit of international flavor. Chaos, he's got really everything in the kitchen sink in his yeah. repertoire. Yeah. Cut. Oh. Dropping Wolf on his face. Okay. If we possibly, yes, he's calling for it. This could be the 450. He's got more than enough top rope aerial assault to put away. Even the newcomers, newcomers, veterans, all the life. 450! These men have hit the chest. Either way, it's over. Chaos returns with a bang. Wolf is down and out. Chaos victorious. No ring rust whatsoever, can you tell? Come on! Surely devoting that victory to the animal Kyle Center. 
putting up an effort though. No question about it. Continues to grow before our eyes. Wait a minute. Award nominations didn't even get one nomination outside of most impactful finisher. Fresh off winning that championship at Uprising. And he beat up Mo Dingo along the way. Part of defenseless wolf right after the fact. That's two rookies he's practically indisposed. So, for those of you who don't know who I am because you're new fans or whatever the excuse may seem to be, I am the American champion, okay? I'm the American champion, Ian Lockhart. And explain to me. I'm the only one not booked at this event. And you want to know why? Because Twisted Wicked J. He's scared to come back to face me for what he thought belonged to him. And just like him, if anybody at any time wants to try and take what's mine, I'll end your career too. Ian Lockhart not showing the attitude of a Ian Lockhart not showing the attitude of a champion. There is no attitude of a champion when the only one worthy of being a champion. Getting very uncalled for behavior by the American champion. We're just getting started. A second pre-show match. Straight ahead. <laughs> 